Hello guys, Serognos here with yet another tutorial video on brand new game optimization software for Lospex PCs called Lospex Experience. More info about Lospex Experience if you're interested you can find on my download page, so make sure to check that out. In today's video I'll be showing you how to optimize Need for Speed Rivals for your Lospex PC and improve performance. So basically everything you need to do is to download the setup file for Lospex Experience from my website, link is in the description, and then install it. I think this is the easiest way to do so, I won't go over everything in every single detail on how to install it, how to extract and stuff like that. If you don't know how to do it, you have a video on my website right below download button, so you can uh, watch that if you need any help. I fully explained it there, so make sure to check that out if you don't know how to do it. In this short video I'll just show you how to use it and how to optimize your game. After you install it, uh, you'll get this shortcut on your desktop. Make sure to right click on it and then run as administrator. Once you open it, this screen should pop up. Click on Low Specs Experience, then select Need for Speed Rivals. And this menu should load. What I need you to do here is to simply select the resolution you want to run your game on and it will automatically optimize your game for your PC in the background. It will replace files needed for this optimization and you'll get this message down here. Once it finishes optimizing, uh, you will get a message to start your game. This game requires some additional configuration and pre-configuration to lower the resolution under the minimum allowed in options. Resolutions which require CMD or command prompt configuration uh, are marked as CMD as you can see in the name. As you can see it clearly says CMD. And once you select which resolution you want, it will create a shortcut to configured file which you need to open from your desktop before you start your game. So simply double click it and then start your game. It will force lower resolution after 60 seconds in game. And at the very end of this video, if you are not happy with the results or the look of the graphics, you can always restore default game settings. Just click on restore default and it will restore default settings. Just like that. Also one more thing to note, if you have any problems, questions or anything to ask related to Lost Specs experience, make sure to contact us through support tab and we'll gladly answer all of your questions, usually under 48 hours. And yeah, that's it for this video, like the video if you like it, dislike if you disliked it, leave a comment below, share with your friends, do whatever you want, also make sure to support me on social media such as Facebook or Twitter, I don't know, every like comment is appreciated. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel, since it's the best way to get video updates and information related to everything including Lost Specs experience, right off the bat. Without any further ado, I'll see you next time with a whole new video, bye bye.